This is the Great Skull mod, and this is the version of it with pathfinding, so that means it'll be able to follow me everywhere throughout the level. I'm gonna be trying to beat as much of Bone Lab as possible before this thing catches me, because if it does, it explodes. Anyway, let's get into the video. I've got some basic strategies, but that's pretty much it. The rules are after this level, the Great Skull must be spawned at the very beginning of the level. I can stand as far away as the dev tool allows me to. The lucky thing about this first level is I can spawn it up here. Now I can head down. And we get a little bit of a head start here. Oh, it's coming. Okay. Okay. Another thing. It can go through walls. Just because it spawned up there does not mean it's not going to be able to find me. Oh, it's so scary not knowing where it is. <laughs> I think I'm going to get lucky this first one. I hope so anyway. I've played this game so many times that I, I kind of know my way around. It's like a mix between a speed run and a horror movie. These skulls are so much less scary now. Oh my god. Don't get stuck here. I have yet to hear the music and that's even more scary to me. I heard the music briefly. I don't think I've ever played through this level faster. Open up! Oh my god. I wish we could put a camera on the skull and you guys could just see its POV this whole time. I swear I just heard the music. I've been stuck right here for so long. Sorry y'all, coming through. Ignore me, ignore me. Okay, this has to be my record for beating this level. Okay, that's gonna be the easiest one of the day, so that's not great. But hey, we got one under our belt. All right, here we are again. Just stand as far away as I can. There it is. All right, we're actually out of the range of the music pretty quickly, so that, that might be a good sign for us. Oh my, thank God they updated this to add this. I would be stuck on this ladder. This is where the run would end. I outran this one pretty quickly again. If I get to the end of this without seeing this thing, I think we gotta go with a faster one. Okay, I'm getting a little nervous now. That took me a bit longer than I would have liked it to. This stupid plug puzzle, oh my God, okay. Okay, we haven't been caught by any of them yet, so I'm thinking we go with the slightly faster version. All right. Okay, this is way faster. Oh my god. Oh my god. It is still right by- Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god! Get out of there! <laughs> Jesus! Watch out, y'all! Blew up on the null body. Get out of the way! I only have one shot. Oh my god! I fell. That's okay. Oh, oh my god. Okay, I actually got far enough away to lose the music. I'm so close to leaving. Oh my god, I made it through, I made it through. Okay, that was stressful, but at least it was possible. The only part I'm worried about is waiting for the cart on this one. I feel like it's gonna be fine after that. Okay, yeah, this is, this is gonna be a bit of a problem. What if I can bait it all the way back here? Okay, if I can get it to follow me to right here. Is it gonna come from under me? Yes. How is it not exploded? Oh my god! Leave me alone! It's gaining on me! Okay, I think we're getting away from it. I know we have to pause right here, but I think we're fine. Oh. Okay, we're good. We're good the rest of the level now. That was a little stressful there for a second, I'm not gonna lie to you. Because of my own made-up house rule, I technically have to spawn him from right here. This is so scary. Okay, I'm really worried about this vent jump right here. Okay, we're gonna need the shotgun to clear this room. Where 
everything is stressful right until you get a bit of distance between you, and then it's pretty much calm. Okay, the skull is no longer my biggest worry. It's being killed by these regular guys. Oh. That null body actually just saved me by shooting that head crab. I was about to die. Jimmy, you wouldn't believe it. There's a skull chasing me, Jimmy. The skull! Oh my god. Jimmy. Okay. Street Puncher is 100% a run ender at this point. I have to kill a certain amount of people to make it through each area, which means the skull will have ample time to catch up to me. Oh my god. Dude. All quiet here. Oh my god. Oh my god. Come on. Blow that guy up. Yes. The skull's on my team now. Let's go. Leave me alone. At some point, I absolutely lost the skull. We shouldn't have too many issues, although we will be stuck in this hallway for quite a bit. Okay, I stand corrected. The skull's here. One of those guys is still alive. No. The skull bugged out the elevators. No, 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 no. Oh, God. So it looks like Street Puncher is my limit for beating the Great Skull. If you guys want to try this out for yourself and you don't own Bone Lab yet, or you just want to get 10% off any MetaQuest game, use the affiliate link in the description below. You'll not only support my channel, but save 10% on any game you buy. I'll also leave links to this mod so you can give it a shot for yourself. Tell me if you beat me and get farther than Street Puncher in the game. This was incredibly hard. And when I would go through load areas, sometimes I would have to respawn the skull just because it would be in the previous load area making any distance i gained on it pretty much nil until i could make up some more space between it this could be possible to beat if i went a little bit faster so i will not be surprised at all if people tell me they beat the game this is just how far i can make it on my very first try massive shout out to my top tier channel member leo don't forget to subscribe if you like videos like this and watch this video next because youtube says it's the best one for you real quick before this video ends i just want to mention that i make short form content like this all the time both here on youtube and over on my tiktok if you're looking for the latest mods i cover it's definitely a good idea to get subscribed so you can see these shorts pop up for you more. If you were subscribed with the notification bell, you would have seen this short pop up a few days ago, where I cover this exact mod. Someone told me I missed the greatest part of the Great Skull mod, which was the extremely fast variant. Not gonna lie to you, I might have missed this one on purpose. This thing is supposed to fly super fast towards your direction at all times and explode if it makes contact with you, so that sounds like fun. Ah!